Aloha kako. My name is Dr. Helmut Kay. I run the research program at Leeward Community College, which is located in Pearl City, Hawaii, with my buddy here, Dr. Neopane. And we've been doing this together off and on, not off and on, I guess the off part was the pandemic, but uh, you know, for 12-ish years or so. We, I have the, this YouTube channel that I use just to upload our lectures and that kind of stuff, uh, demo videos, but I've been always meaning to do like a vlog-based type of uh, production, vlog-based type of content. And so this is kind of a feeler out there as we'll navigate this world and see how this goes. One of our former students, uh, Rayson Ramos, this is him here presenting his uh, first poster at the Inbre Biomed Symposium, which is at the medical school here in Hawaii. Uh, he's a wonderful personality. He's a fantastic singer, right? If you like singing with people who are great at karaoke, ask Grayson to come along with you. And he's really blossomed in from uh, what was kind of a, a silly little boy into someone who is now actually conducting his own undergraduate research project uh, at uh, the medical school. Um, he was able to take his work uh, that he did with us, presented at a national conference. This is him in Portland with my partner in crime, Dr. Neopane, or Noop Dog as some of the kids call him. And uh, one of the things that Rayson did recently, he's actually been helping us TA our molecular biology classes. But one of the things that he did was he was just kind of goofing around with uh, one of our wireless microphones. Happened to be a day that the students were taking their micro or molecular biology exam. And just kind of impromptu, he just started interviewing everybody. So I figured this would be a really nice starter content, probably a little bit longer than the kind of content that I would like to put out. I don't really like to have super long videos, right? But it was this is basically Rayson showing off his personality, his uh, his group, and then you get to see some of the students that come in and out um, in our molecular biology classes. But it's a it's a fun intro to these kinds of things. Moving forward in the future, I think what I would like to do is have some interviews with some of our undergraduate researchers, maybe do some mini presentations of the work that they're doing. Sometimes we get some interesting results in the lab classes and maybe we can, uh, I'll show off some of those things, maybe do some fermentation demos. I'm a hobby fermenter and, but anyways, no idea where this is gonna go, no idea how often things will appear on this channel. Um, like, like life, we'll just see what happens, right? And so, uh, We'll start off with uh, a little bit of racing and our cell, my molecular, cell and molecular biology students. All right, first one in line. All right, what's your name? Gabe. What's your profession? Business. Okay, yeah, he's cooked. <laughs> Here, Mr. Mananin, um, how are you feeling on this exam? A hundred. Uh, out of all of the, the, the chapters, what was the hardest? Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Seven. All right, what, 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 what is the hardest thing in seven? DNA replication. <laughs> it's not even, that's not even it. <laughs> You heard it here, folks. <laughs> Tragedy is about to strike. Can you, can you explain your shirt to me real quick, sir? It's the fifth element on the periodic table. Confusion is what you are today, right, sir? Yeah. All right, next student in the line. We have the next student in the line. My name is Bree. I'm, I'm your dad, and I think you're going to be a boy. <laughs> <laughs> OK, what is the hardest chapter so far? I think nine. What is chapter nine? What is the subject in chapter nine? That's a very good question, Rayson. <laughs> 75 out of 100, okay. I'm okay, I'm 75. Gonna low ball and I'm gonna get the C. Okay, go for this. That's a, that's a safe choice. Yeah. Okay, um, describe what is the chart, what is the process of charging a tRNA? What does that mean? The tRNA is attached to the amino acid by hydrolysis of an ATP molecule. When tRNA has an, a bound amino acid, is that charged or uncharged? It's charged. Charged, right? And where does it drop it off? Where? <laughs> Please introduce yourself. My name is Janice Shiana Manzano, yeah. at Janus. At Jan, at Janus underscore. To this, what was uh, the hardest chapter for you? Uh, chapter eight. What was chapter eight on? I don't know. That's why it was the hardest. What do you think you're gonna get on the exam? Uh, seventy six. Wow, you're the highest one. You definitely didn't lowball, huh? I'm just. You got I'm a manifest. You got a manifest. I'm fuck, you got a manifest. You got a manifest. What's your handle again? By the way, she's, she's um, engaged. 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 I'm not wearing it, but engaged. All right. Thank you so much, Janice. I'm, I'm here with the boy. Um, what's your name? Kobe Mac at Hawaii.edu. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what's the GPA? Uh, you know, college is more about the experience, not the numbers. <laughs> I like that. Why, why medicine? 
you know, it's about the experience. And <laughs> what is the hardest chapter for you for this exam? Chapter five. I'm still not. I'm still not over exam one. I'm, I'm not. I don't even think I'm ready for exam. What grade do you think you're gonna get for this? Hopefully, like a W or a, or a U. Oh. I just. Oh. I, <laughs> He said withdraw. He said, I'm taking this 275 with Dr. Howard Shin. <laughs> so he's taking the dub for this one. And I'm not talking about the win. <laughs> Come here. All right. You have your exam too today. What's your name? Jen. What are you listening to? Listening? Yeah. Like, what, like, what are you listening to? <laughs> okay. What was the hardest chapter for you? Chapter 9. And what was, and what was chapter 9? Something about mutation. Mutations. And what do you think your grade's going to be for this exam too? Honestly, just hope I get a 75. I'm gonna lowball myself. Oh, that's lowballing. I don't know that's about that. Completely I'm, I'm fucking, I'm fucking, I'm fucking. Yeah, 75. I'm hoping for a 75. Hey, you, come here. Did <laughs> First of all, come in. First of all, what's your name? Erin. Erin what? Tamayo. Erin Tamayo. Where did you guys come from? Because you guys are kind of late. You guys' exams are like 30 minutes. Okhem Lab. How was Okhem Lab? It was fun. Professor T bought a subway. He bought you a subway? Yeah. That's fire. I know, right? What chapter was the hardest for you, Erin? Um, 9 and 10 because I didn't get to study those. I know 10 is like application and then 9 is mutation. 9 mutation, good. What do you think you're going to get on the exam? <laughs> I'm going to get probably like a 50. No, you got it. All right, we have a third and final person here. Get over here. What's your name? Bella. That was great. She's going to UW, by the way, next no, semester. Fingers crossed. All right, what is the hardest chapter for you? All of them. If you had to pick one. Ten? I, that's a common answer right now. Um, has check been working? What? Has check been working? <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know what that is. <laughs> All right, Bella, what do you think you're going to get on your exam? 80. No, Pro, no, 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 no. I apologize. That was an inappropriate reaction. That was an inappropriate reaction. 80 is a good score. Any last words before you come in? Class. <laughs> Again, another common answer. Don't worry. We're gonna um, do a, a little after interview and see how they actually like it. All right. So, update. They're about to take their exam. It's 12:59, and the stress is absolutely through the roof. What is a microRNA? What is a microRNA? RNAi. What does that blocks mean? Blocks the blocks the translation. It doesn't go through the ribosome. Correct. You gotta do it, dude. Yeah. What's, what's a microRNA? I forgot. Oh, no, don't forget. Don't forget. Right now, I'm stressed out even as the TA. Operator, oh my. the binding, the binding site. Correct. Binding yes, yeah. Site. Correct. Okay. You're good. You're good. At least I'm like high, high stress environment type of deal. I got to proctor the exam. Man, just wish them luck, okay? The first contender is out. She finished her exam, and we're gonna wait for her to come out from the bathroom, and we're gonna ask how she's been doing. Ba -bum, ba -ba -bum. All right, we're here with Bree. It was okay. Better than the first? Yeah. You think you did better than you think you did better, or do you know you did better? I think I I know I did better. Okay, that's good. Yeah. That's good. I bet it was like the restriction enzyme and plasmid, and plasmid right? Oh, a knockout. And the knockout, yes. Uh, can I ask what are the two restriction enzymes you used to cut your plasmid? I have no idea. Like, okay. <laughs> How do you feel like our study session went? Did you think that this helped you or what? Yeah, yeah. It did? Yeah. It helped you? Cause they were definitely thrown in last minute, 100%. Because uh, I was going around and I said, oh, I remember that from last year. But I don't remember talking about that at all during our study sessions. You got all four of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm, I'm like super confident in them. So... I think I got, I think, four multiple choice questions wrong. I got most of the matching correct. I think I just, like, for one of the matching, I just flipped. But now we have our second contender, and we were both wrong. It was not Gabriel Maninen. Instead, it was... 99. Oh, my goodness. Who is it? What? What's your name? Jen. Jen. How was everything? I think half of those questions explaining and... I really suck at explaining, so let's just see. It's all in the hands of Dr. Neopane, right? <laughs> how do you feel like how do you feel like our study um, session helped? That was awesome. I didn't have confidence like a week ago and then for like the last two days, like just talking about it and asking questions, it kinda like got stuck in my head. Okay, good. Good. It clicked, good. right? It clicks it now, right? Okay. There's definitely a lot 
that we covered, that we talked about, that was there. Can I ask you, if you had to play a song right now, what song would you be playing? Oh my God, I don't know. Um, Three Little Birds. Okay, Three Little Birds. No. Don't worry about, about a thing. thing. All right. We have the third contender. The third contender coming in. The one who I thought was going to be second. We have... <sighs> What's your name? Gabe. All right, Gabe. How do you think you did? 50 at least. You know, oh, you don't, you need to check, right? No. Feel better about this exam or worse? Worse. Why worse? Because I guessed a little more. I use my photographic memory. Oh, to get that 515 NCAT, right? Yes, sir, dude. 515 practice MCAT. Come on, 515 practice MCAT first try. Didn't even study. I there actually skipped the car section. <laughs> oh, okay, well. Nobody ever has a problem with the cars, by the way. How, how was over your experience? During that exam? Mm, it was pretty miserable, honestly. I caught Nupani camping behind a, um, a, a fucking jar, like, <laughs> watching me like this. <laughs> how did you feel like the stuff that I told you to do? Did that help or what? It helped. It definitely helped. I felt prepared. More prepared than I thought I would be. I don't know, I don't, I don't buy it. If you had to play a song, what song would you play? All of the Lights. Oh, that's a good song. That's a good, that's, that's valid. That's a good choice. Good song, dude. All right, that was Gabriel Manonen. All right, there's somebody here that I don't want to, it looks like I don't want to, I don't want to bother her too much. She was the fourth person out of the exam, the one who I thought was going to come out sixth. Who do we have here? Michelle Barut. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle Barut, aka Janice. <laughs> How was the exam? All the explanations. So much words. Those, those are cheese though. When I had like one explanation that I had about maternal and stem cells, and then I also had the experiment one, and then I had shotgun sequencing. Do you think you did better or worse? Worse. I think, I think you did better, but we're gonna see. Head up, don't worry. Two more exams. And you know what? You killed it your first exam. Oh my god. Give me knuckles. You killed it. Who do you think is gonna be the next one out? It's gotta be my boy Alex, right? It's gotta like, be. He's the best. I'm just like that guy, you know? Yeah. All right. Oh, we have the big man in here, Dr. Nyopane. I want to get a real quick interview with Dr. Nyopane. Yeah. How G I can get in front of my professor. Hello, Dr. Nyopane. Hello, hello, Rayson. Hello. What's your name? Uh, Dr. Nyopane. So, from what you're seeing so far, are you happy with what's going on? Uh, I think so. Yeah? I think so. I, I don't know what's going on. Uh, I would say it's a lot better. A lot better? I, I would think from first exam, yeah. Okay, that's good. People studied well yeah. then, yeah. They that's probably have like a good TA or something, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you don't self-promote, right? So I, I got to ask Brianna, is he a good TA or somebody? Yeah, because we, we have like overnight sessions when we go to Starbucks. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. There you heard it. You heard it from student testimonials and Dr. Kavi Nyopane. We have our next contender coming up. We have Miss Denisha Stokely here. Denisha Stokely. We're here with Denisha Stokely. I just want to say it, it was a hard beginning, right, Denisha? You came in late, a little bit late, well, what, eight minutes late? How much was it? Oh my God, yeah, like about... About, about, about 10 minutes late, right? Okay, I'm going to ask you, how, how do you think the exam went? Better than I thought. Better than you thought. Okay. Oh my God, okay, so this is really exciting. Well, you're, you're definitely not one of the students that like... You're definitely not one of the students that upset. So I'm going to look at it, and I'm going to see, and I'm, I'm pretty sure you cooked. I hope so. If you had to play a song, any song right now, to reflect how you're feeling, what song would you be playing? I'm putting on a spot like that. Now I can't name it. I know, yeah. Take your time. <laughs> we are the champion. We are the champion. She's definitely like the cooker in the class. She cooks. She eats. She's hungry. We had another contender who snuck past me. Um, who is this contender? Please come here. Please contender number, I think, six. Who are you? My name is Erin. Erin what? Tamayo. This is like the second time I asked you. You gotta say first and last. So what's your middle name? What's, what's your, um, your, your mother's maiden name? Bro, you, someone hacked into my PayPal and took like $141 from my account. Womp womp. Anyways, I'm just kidding. <laughs> how, how was um, exam two? You know, I feel relieved. You know, I, 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 didn't, I haven't been getting a lot of sleep. First score in, and your second score. Do you feel like you did better or worse? Honestly, racing gave me a high five, so I think I feel a lot more better about my score. <laughs> How did you study for this exam if if you didn't come to the set to, to the study sessions? I read the textbook, and I what is it called? I used the images, and then I was like writing down notes. I want to show you guys my notes. 